it is mom's birthday as of yesterday. How old are you, mom? Do you want to tell anyone? 52. She's 52, so we're celebrating by hanging out in Bardstown and doing some fall things today. So stay tuned. <laughs> you think about mom's birthday. I think it's great. Are you excited for her? I am. Great. Draw me close I wanna hear your heartbeat I wanna feel your breath on my cheek Pull me in, draw me closer I wanna hear your heartbeat Hey y'all, so we just got back from shopping in downtown Bardstown. I bought way too many things and I'm so excited to show y'all in my next fall lookbook that I'm about to do. I bought some really cute sweater vests. I'm into the trend, I'm trying it out. And then this really, really cute shirt. It says pumpkins please for fall. I thought it was perfect. I can't wait to wear this going through like a pumpkin patch or something along those lines. I think it's perfect for that. So I'm super excited. Hey y'all, so as you can see, I am actually back in my apartment, in my bedroom actually. So I'm not in Bardstown anymore. My camera actually died that day and then the memory card was completely full so I had to delete everything off my camera. You don't care, long process, had to figure it out and actually it's still doing that now where it's saying like I have no space in my memory card but I have deleted all the videos off my camera. So we'll see if I can figure it out but I'm probably gonna have to order a new memory card. Anyways, so the rest of that day was great. It was a really good day. We took my mom out to dinner in Louisville at one of our favorite Italian restaurants called Valare. Really great spaghetti bolognese. I would totally recommend it. She absolutely loves Italian food so that was her pick for her birthday. We surprised her with it. I had a really good day with my mom though. On another sad note, Kalen did not hang out with us that day until dinner time because he had a really sad weekend. He had to put down his dog that they have had for nine years. Um, his name was Chief and he was a little yellow lab and he ended up developing cushy disease and so he could barely stand up on his own was just in really really awful shape and they had to make the sad decision to put him down so it was such a sad weekend for them but I think it was for the best so Kaylin had a little bit more of a sad day but I, I had a really good day downtown I was obviously sad for him and for his family but we ended up turning it around and he came over and had a good time for dinner so I know it's always sad when you have to say goodbye to you know a family relative like that you know pets aren't just they aren't just pets they're relatives they're like a part of your family so it's super hard and it made me sad about thinking about when we'll have to put our family dogs down one day which hopefully 
is knock on wood, not in the near future. I just wanted to explain a little bit about, you know, how the rest of my day went and not just cut off where I was there. Oh, quick side note, this sweatshirt is so cute, super soft. You can probably see the inside here, super soft and comfy. Oh, and this is what, I rolled it up because I have short arms, but this is what the sleeves look like. And it looks like that around the bottom of the sweatshirt too. I actually ended up getting a large in the sweatshirt because I love them super oversized and cozy. And that's why the sleeves are so long, but it covers my bum just right. Super loose, almost looks like a dress with leggings, which is what we go for. So I loved this Kentucky sweatshirt. And I got it at a little boutique downtown, along with my other little sweater vest that I'm gonna show you all in a fashion lookbook here soon. But I loved the entire day and my mom had a really good time. So we are at the craft fair in Bardstown today. I'm here with my mom. She doesn't want to be filmed. <laughs> <laughs> but yeah, this is cute little, what do they sell mom? Like artsy, arts craft, and arts and crafts things. Anything probably bourbon related. So we'll go check it out and probably buy a lot of things cause we always do that. <laughs> you remind me of the perfect summer day But only in picture frames Cause I was picking up the pieces when the Away. You had me all alone I was drowning in your awkward silence I feel loosening the chains around my neck But it makes no difference Hey, I was looking at a photograph of a photo you left Reminding me of places we used to go But it makes no difference Hey, and if I could arrive in town It would you work mine It wouldn't cover up all the scars you left Cause it makes no difference Chillin' on the West Coast in LA But it was a Monday And I was dreaming of the perfect getaway But all you wanted was to get away from me Just a small town girl living in a lonely world. Thank you all so much for watching my video. If you liked it, then please hit that like button below and subscribe to my channel if you want to see more of me. I hope that you all have a great week and I will see you next time. Bye. Stay tuned.